Minnesota Attorney General Keith Ellison led the prosecution. He said he accepts the lesser sentence for Potter and he is urging others to do the same. Our Caroline Cummings had a chance to speak with him after today's decision. Good evening, Frank. Ellison says everyone has the right to disagree with that sentence, but Judge Chu rendered her decision according to law. Accountability, he says, is just one step towards justice, and he hopes going forward the community finds healing. He believes justice is also involves restoration, mercy, compassion, and even forgiveness. He called the loss of Dante Wright incalculable and acknowledged the family's deep grief and disappointment disappointment with today's sentence. Dante Wright's um, life cannot be measured in the number of years that Kim Potter did or didn't get. Uh, Dante Wright's life is measured in the people who loved him and that love is infinite. And so that's what I say. I, I say that, uh, that you've got to make room in your heart for a grieving mom. Ellison also told me that he thinks Kim Potter could play an important role going forward. He suggested that she could be part of the solution in policing so other families don't suffer the same pain as the Wright family. All right, Caroline, thank you. Keep watching WCCO and CBS News Minnesota for any new developments.